For the Milano Hole 7, all these shots I have played at mid-distance with a plus 15% over adjustment of my shot. I have yet to get a headwind, but I think the headwind's going to play around 20% elevation at mid-distance of your club. So here I'm doing 4.5 backspin and I'm aiming my ball guide at the hole. And this one I did hit a great, but I think with below a 9 mile an hour wind, I think you can drop it down to a plus 10% over adjustment of your shot. And anything over 9, I would use a plus 15% to compensate for that wind push that you will get. So a crosswind and a tailwind, if it's below 9 mile an hour, I would use plus 10% over adjustment of your shot with 4.5 backspin. And anything greater than 9, I would use a plus 15 in a headwind, I would use a plus 20. Here we have a tail crosswind and I did adjust this at mid distance with a plus 15% over adjustment of my shot and you can see that it was over pulled. So again, anything below a nine, I would use a plus 10% over adjustment of my shot at mid distance of my club. In a tail and cross, you're gonna use four and a half backspin and in a headwind, I would probably drop it down to about four bars of backspin. Here I had a 9 mile per hour wind and I played with a plus 20% over adjustment of my shot at mid distance. This was way over adjusted and also I did too little backspin. So from here I know that the shot is going to play anything above a 9 wind. You're going to play with a plus 15% over adjustment of your shot at mid distance. Anything below a 9, you're going to be adjusting with a plus 10% over adjustment at mid distance. And in the headwind, I do believe it's going to play at a plus 20 or a plus 25, depending on the strength of the headwind. So again, guys, hopefully this all helps you out on this uh, hole. And remember, hit perfect and happy golfing.